As we head into Labor Day weekend with those refineries still closed, some people are rushing to the pump to fill up, fearing gas stations will run out of fuel. However, the Railroad Commissioner of Texas says there's no need to worry here. KETK's Kara Pritchard joins us live from one of those gas stations in Tyler. Kara, a lot of viewers want to know if there's no need to worry here, why are some stations running out of fuel? Casey, what many people told me today is they're filling up just in case some stations in Central Texas, like you mentioned, are running out of gas, including a few here in East Texas. I just found out this Valero on the loop has run out of gas because of the increase in people rushing to fill up their tanks. It's unusual like people come in and buying the gas more today. After word spread about a possible gas shortage, demand for fuel is now spiking. We've been told that like we have to order our gas in 48 hour advance before we used to order 24 hours in advance. Uh, now most likely I'll run out of gas by this evening. While City Fuel Express may be on the verge of running out for now, Energy Secretary and former Texas Governor Rick Perry says the feds are closely monitoring supplies. The Colonial Pipeline has been shut down. That is a major deliverer of refined product to the southeastern United States. According to AAA, gas prices in Texas have gone up a little more than 10 cents in a week, driven up by demand. I'm coming to get fuel. I have a business that requires that I use fuel on a daily basis. Many people in Tyler, like Mr. Griffiths, got in line Thursday to fill up in case. Gas station attendants on the south side of the city say they're not worried about running out. The lines are just good for business. We have a lot of good people here in Texas that are going to make sure things go right. One thing's for sure, despite these lines, there's no shortage of fuel in the Lone Star State. It just may take a little longer to get from refinery to the pump. Now we have found several other stations either running low or running completely out of fuel and we are keeping a close eye on the situation. We'll have much more coming up tonight at 10. Reporting live in Tyler, Care Pritchard, KTK News. And with the talk of refinery 